What's poppin' everyone? It's Big Bath another video. Today we're gonna god boost the cave monkey. Uh, the cave monkey and the god boost of village are my two favorite mods, so pairing them up is gonna be pretty cool. We're gonna do it immediately though, because the cave monkey can't really survive past the round we're at, which is round 10. Uh, maybe he can, but not for too, too long. So we're gonna give him the tech bot treatment of getting the overclocks from the beginning. Because that's going to be the main thing that's going to power him up through all this. Um, once we have the money, we're going to get the other upgrades. So where is this tech? Oh, here he is. Alright. And once it can overclock, we're going to do it to the cave monkey. And the tech bot is going to just automatically do it from that point on. We could, probably, we could speed up a little bit. Let's turn off the auto start. There we go. Should be automatic. Oh, I forgot to link it to him. All right, there we go. It's gonna be automatic now. This man's gonna get much faster. He's already pretty fast. This is good. And he's one-shotting the yellow balloons. He's even one-shotting the pink. Let's see what he does. Black. No, he does not one-shot the black. Let's see. And he does not have camo detection just yet. We're gonna we're gonna have to give him the camo detection just for a while. Just for the moment until we get the True Sun God Village upgrade, which should be coming decently soon. And it's going to be interesting to see how far this man can get without that as well, honestly. So he's at 15 overclock, so he has to be attacking fast now. Yeah, he's attacking pretty quickly. I'm hoping he can beat the first Moab. I think he can, but let's see. We'll see. Oh, yep, he did. That was pretty easy. All right, let's continue. We're getting pretty close to the next upgrade for the Sun God Village to make it the true Sun God. And this man is going to be even more OP. He's probably going to get to a point where this man just stays in a frozen animation and looks like he's attacking with his mind. <laughs> yeah, so he's definitely defeating these rainbow balloons as they come out. There's nothing to worry about there. Uh, it's going to be more interesting when we see more grouped balloons than that because this man is attacking faster than the rate of balloons at the moment. Let's do the true sun god village. Oh my god, this man one-shot ceramics. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Yeah, the Moabs don't stand a chance. He's at 32 overclock, so he's definitely extremely fast right now. But we don't even really get to see that because of uh, the fact that there's not really that many groups. Uh, there is at 63 though, so let's see if 63 looks different. Alright, we're about to start right now. Alright, there they are. Oh my god, he destroyed them like they were nothing. Okay, this man's gonna definitely be able to last for a very long time. So I'm just gonna turn back the auto start. And let's just speed it up a little. Oh my goodness, look at this. Yeah, the BFB stood no chance. Oh my god. This is insane. <laughs> yeah, I'd love the Cape Monkey. Alright, we're almost at the vengeful true sun god village. There it is. Alright, this man has all the help he needs. The only thing he doesn't have are the support abilities and the debuff abilities, which we might do at the end. We probably will. Let's see what this man looks like without the speed up. This is not sped up. This is literally not sped up. This man's using his mind at this point. Oh my god, there's no regular balloons that can get past him. It's really just up to Moabs at this point. The biggest threat is definitely going to be the bads, though. So that's the thing we're going to have to look out for. I think the first bad will be Cake. But as the bads keep on gaining uh, health and speed as the rounds continue on in free play, it's going to get pretty hard to beat them. Most god boosted things that I've played so far haven't really gotten to round 300. I don't think this man will be the diff, the one that can because, you know, I mean, he's not the best tower necessarily, but he's definitely going off more than I've seen from a lot of towers, so that's pretty good. That, that's pretty good. Maybe uh, he'll prove me wrong. Alright, he's at 80 overclocks now, and we're almost at round 100. Alright, let's see how he does against this bat. See how quickly he destroys it. Look, it's just like a mind power. So, okay, so he doesn't do as much damage to the bats as the other balloons, that's for sure. But it wasn't really a problem for him, I'll say. 
So we're just gonna keep on uh, continuing the rounds and see if this man starts to have trouble. I don't think he will for quite a while. It'll probably be about the round two, around 200-ish will start to have trouble. That's my guess. I'm gonna speed up a little faster even. All right, we're at 111, going up quickly. This man's almost at 100 over clocks, which is insane. Yeah, they're all just stopping uh, at this little area. They don't even get to the intersection. The only ones that do are the bads. And he's at over 100 overclocks now. Yeah, this cave monkey is going pretty crazy. He's doing much, much, much better than I thought he would. I'm going to get rid of this monkey village. Alright, um, I'm not going to do the abilities until we get close to losing. Uh, I wonder what this man looks like when he's overclocked normally. Let's see. <laughs> There's like no change because of how fast he already is. That is ridiculous. There's a slight change. Not much. Look, it looks like this man's actually destroying them with his mind. He basically is. Oh, the, okay, the fortified bads are definitely a problem at this point. So we're going to upgrade the Sun God Village to do the support abilities and the debuffs, which are the Glue Storm and Fire Storm. Um, those aren't going to be too, too helpful, I don't think. But maybe with this, um, with the Cave Monkey, they will be. And the Cave Monkey seems to be really good at getting DDTs as well, so that's good. I don't think fortified DDTs will do too much more of a problem for him. Yeah, this man is going kind of off. Okay, he beat the bads. He's having trouble a little early, earlier than the other towers. Uh, you gotta give it to him. That's because, you know, he's probably one of the weakest in game, if not the weakest. But, uh, it's all good because he's still going off. He had three bads. Couldn't, he, he took those on, so... What I'm more worried about is the fortified bads, and I'm almost even worried that he won't even get to the fortified bads, but so far, so good. Alright, I'm speeding up as fast as it can go. Hopefully my computer can keep running it. Oh no. Is this the round? Is this the round where he loses? Let's see. Alright, let's see this in slow motion, because we just lost him fast. So let's see what happens. Okay, I think Ben's ability sometimes messes up, messes me up. Alright. He's just damaging so far. Everything looks kinda good, but I will say he doesn't damage the bads. It kind of, he doesn't really damage them enough. He really doesn't. So I guess he's really, really good at handling group balloons, but really bad at handling high HP Moabs. So it's definitely gonna just get worse and worse and worse for him. Uh, I don't expect that he can last much longer than this round if he lasts past this round, because as we saw the during the speed up, speed up, he lost. But that could kind of be some kind of RNG because of uh, the Ben um, hack, which makes him stop attacking for a couple seconds. So if there's a DDT that passes by in those few seconds, it's going to mess him up. So let's see if that's what it was. I'm going to speed it up until the bads come. Unless they don't, I think that might have been it. Yeah. Alright, yeah, he beat the round, I think. So, he was able to beat that, so it turns out it was kind of RNG a little. So that's good, we can continue. Yeah, this man is crazy. I'm about to, um... I'm probably gonna take off these buffs and just go back to what I was doing with, uh... Just the overclocks. Because the buffs are kind of slowing things down. And not actually helping too much, honestly. They're kind of the reason we lost a few times, so... I forgot to do that. Alright, Tech Talk should go back to overclocking him again. We're at 163 overclocks, that's nuts. I will say there's a lot of towers that, if they were at that, they would be much stronger. But I'm actually really impressed right now. Cave Monkey's nice. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. This might be it. This might be it. This 
might be it. No, it, this is it. No! Come on, Cable. <laughs> Whoa. Yep, that's it. That is it. Alright, he lasted till round 154. Let's put the abilities back on, see if he can last a little longer. I don't expect to last too much longer. I mean, he already died with the abilities once because of the RNG, so I don't know if they're going to help too much. There we go. Come on. No. No. Alright, we're going to give it one more try. Since the abilities came out a little late, we're giving it one more try. If this doesn't work, it's over. So far, so good. See, the Ben's ability can kind of mess him up. Luckily, you know, right there was a good time to use it. That didn't mess him up at all. So the RNG was on our side a tiny bit. I don't think it will be in a second, though. It's about to use it at a really bad time. Oh, no. Okay, so he's, he's boosted at least for a second, but it's not going to make up for the time where he's gone. Okay. No, no, no. So far, so good. So far, so good. Let's see. Alright, that bat got destroyed. Now he needs to take on the second bat. I think he can do it. He did it! Alright. It's still on. Speed it up. Alright, is he doing it? Oh, he... So, yep. Yep. He's, he's got it. He did it. Alright, we're continuing. Look at this man! 173. Oh no, I think he lost. I think he lost. Oh, did he? Did he? Yeah, he did. Alright guys, it looks like he got to... What was it? Round 156. This man is at 175 overclocks. He's completely god boosted with all the abilities to help him. He lasted till one, round 156. You might even want to count it around 155, honestly, but um, this man did kind of better than I thought he was going to do. Definitely the worst uh, god boosted tower, but we all expected that. But uh, he did go off. He really did. So if there's any other towers you want me to god boost, let me know in the comments and I'll uh, probably get to it pretty soon. Uh, until then, I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!